another one. The police killed another one. Different day, same story. Ain't nothing changed but the details. We are tired of the violence, tired of the same sad excuses, and so we march. We march, we shout, wield our words demanding justice. Still, nothing changes. Nobody listens. Politicians hide in their offices. Stone-faced troopers block our path. Police, protecting property instead of people, stand in front of empty buildings. Dark and boarded windows look out over our demonstrations. Our voice bounces from glass to stone to sky, never landing on ears tuned to hear. Those who fancy themselves respectable tell us, go home, vote. Those with power feign interest, tell us to wait for the right time to hope. Y'all are listening, but you don't hear us. If riot is the language of the unheard, graffiti is our art. This can of paint in my hand is my power to make my voice heard. If people won't open their ears, the rocks will receive my cries. Echo them in the light of day, make my voice unignorable. These words are my call to action. Will you join me in my fight for justice or merely paint over my pain? Erase me from memory and let the status quo remain. We walk into work. See your words scrawled across our wall and we weep. Tears we cannot stop scream, sorrow and anger down our cheeks. Not because our building is profane, on the contrary, we weep because of your pain. The words you write are true, black lives do matter, and yet we see the agony of our brothers and sisters as the world tells them that they don't. We watch the nightly news and see protests spilling out into our streets. We weep as we recognize our complicity. We, the church, for too long have been silent, inhospitable, antagonistic even. We've longed for the coming kingdom and forgotten that Christ told us it's already breaking in, forgotten his invitation to participate in the Father's will being done on earth right now as it is in heaven. Your words will stay on our wall to remind us that you are the Imago Dei, the image of the invisible God. Your words remind us of your dignity. Your words convict. Remind us that grace pulls us from death to life, makes us agents of beauty in a broken place. May we work to see the humanity of the other, to turn strangers into friends, to seek justice for our neighbors. May we work to see the kingdom come.